make your point on the news hour join arnab every night on the news hour with your question ask your question and join the debate well a day after times now revealed how a former upa minister backed zakir nayak by writing to the inb minister times now has now accessed the complete letter trail which shows that the then upa minister's unprecedented intervention now the upa minister had urged the inb ministry to seek details on allegations made by a particular channel against zakir nayak this even as the inb ministry had named zakir nayak's peace television as an illegal channel uh, aditi is reporting on this aditi breakdown uh what really happened back then on this because you know the congress party came out and said that in 2013 we did put a ban on the channel and we were proactive but the letter trail that we have uh, got clearly shows that that was not the case In fact, Nupur, if we go back in 2012, this is an unanswered question that was raised in the Lok Sabha of the Parliament, asking if there are any illegal or unauthorized television channels that are being operated by cable operators in India. Interestingly, and in a reply to this particular question, uh, the government of India, the then INB Ministry, had released a list of 24 channels in which, if I can just ask my camera person to zoom in, on number two is Peace TV, which is a channel based out of Dubai and run by Zakir Naik. Now, this happened in the year 20. 2012 mm. now in the year 2013 minority affairs minister rehman khan had written to the inb ministry saying that there is an attempt to defame dr zakir naik a renowned indian islamic scholar and president of the islamic research foundation mumbai now this letter was sent to the inb ministry and had also categorically mentioned a private news channel saying that they were trying to defame zakir naik now post this letter on the 5th of july the inb ministry had sent a notice to this particular channel in which mm. they have said it is requested to provide comments on the above complaint against the program telecasted by this particular channel which is allegedly defaming dr zakir nayak now when this channel did not send a response for almost a month on in august 10th again a letter was sent in which the inb ministry has categorically said strict action will be taken against this particular channel if within 10 days failing which action is deemed fit will be taken without any further notice to you now look at this comes in complete contrast to what the congress party has been claiming all this while the congress party is questioning the nda government and the present bjp government as to why no action was taken in the past but the bigger question here is nupur when mm. in 2012 the government of india itself has said that peace tv is a illegal and unauthorized channel and it will not be allowed to be broadcasted in india then why in the year 2013 a did the minority affairs minister rehman khan even approach the inb ministry regarding defaming of a radical cleric zakir naik and b why did the inb ministry take the move on the request of uh, rehman khan and even sh- uh, send a show cause notice to that particular private channel saying action will be taken against them if they do not come out with a clarification of defaming dr zakir naik so clearly uh, anupur at this point Now, of time the political controversy uh, around zakir naik is just increasing